good morning everybody and welcome back to the nomad motorcycles youtube channel so today i've got something different with us um today this is one of my older builds it's about it's been about four years since we've completed this project but the reason i have her on here today is because the customer has decided that he wants to sell this bike he loves the bike but he just can't seem to find the time for it um he rides it about once a month and has to constantly keep starting it to make sure the battery doesn't die and things like that so i'm going to take you on a quick walk around and if you're interested in the price stick around to the end yeah so there's a cup this is a classic 350 2016 um, it's got, I mean, you guys can all tell how heavy the work that's been done on it is. It has an underbody exhaust, a completely custom subframe, um, leather seat, custom tank with an acrylic petrol gauge. It's got the front fork from the KTM that has been adapted along with a custom aluminium T-plate, um, headlamp from the old Thunderbird with custom headlamp mounts, Smith's gauge, disc brake assembly on the front, disc brake assembly on the back, a one-off custom single side swing arm with a monoshock on the back, uh, it's got custom aluminium knurled foot pegs with a rear, that have been rear set, uh, it's got an engine protector, the the tires on this bike are the Pirelli Sport Demons and the rims are the aluminium rims from the Continental GT that have been buffed up. Actually the tires are also from the Continental GT. Um, it's got clip-ons that have been custom made especially for this bike. Bar end indicators. Um, the tail lamp and the petrol cap have also been knurled out of aluminium to go with the look of the rest of the bike. She's got a little pouch, a, le a little leather pouch to keep your paperwork, um, a leather battery casing, and This is what she looks looks like from the front. The exhaust wrap has started to dull over the years, but that's no big deal. He's also got leather protectors to keep heat guards to keep you from burning your leg on the exhaust. And yeah, that's about it. If you're looking to buy a show-stopping custom Royal Enfield. Um, DM us for the details. The expected price on this is 2.2 lakhs. This is slightly negotiable. The customer has spent more than that just on the modifications of the bike and customizing this bike four years ago. It's also only run about 1200 kilometers since she's been done she's only gone around town she's been kept in covered parking and this is an absolute one-off custom if you like what you see and you're interested in buying please let me know I am really keen on this bike. I normally don't sell bikes. I only customize them. But I'm really keen on this bike going to a good home because she's one of my favorite customs that have gone out through the Nomad Motorcycle Workshop along with maybe Foxhound and a few others here and there. But yeah, thanks so much.